Hi Keith, thanks to me for coming in. Dr. Buckley, how are you? I'm very good, thanks very much. Nice to see you. I saw you on the Late Late Show and I said to you we're going to have to get you in because you were showing everybody your temporary veneers. Yeah, but I've done the Late Late Show again since that Late Late Show. Apparently so, yeah. On Friday, and yeah. I showed them the real thing. Yeah, okay, yeah. good, good. The response has been fantastic, oh, so I'm thank sure you very is. much. Give us a big smile. Yes, okay, so you're happy with them? Hey, buddy! <laughs> <laughs> Because you were known for the chip between your two front teeth. Okay, the chip between the teeth worked for, for the years in the band. People said it gave me character. You know, when I did consider maybe getting a fix, people said, ah, oh, you can't get that fixed. That's your character, that's your trademark. Yeah. When Boys Don't broke up initially in 2000, I started doing a lot more acting work on stage, sure. uh, on, on the small screen. Yeah. For example, I was in Coronation Street for three years and people get to see you and get to see what you look like and that stands out so much, the broken tooth stands out so much that it was difficult for other casting directors to give me work okay. because I was so typecast to the one character because of yeah. things like your broken teeth. So to make you more kind of um, sellable I suppose in, yeah. the, uh, in the acting world you just want to have everything kind of symmetric yeah, yeah. so that you can jump from one role into the next. Change your hair, you're a different character. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whereas the teeth, if they're broken, they stay with every character. Okay. So I don't know if that makes any sense. That makes perfect sense. What, what's it like having them in? I, I, ah, it's, it's, it's great now. Like you said, yeah. the first time I went on the Late Late Show, yeah. I had the temporaries in because yeah. Obviously, when you're getting veneers done, they have to go off to the lab and to be made, yeah. and you've got to change the size. And so, anyway, I was on the Late Late Show. Uh, the temporaries I thought were great. Obviously, you went crazy because <laughs> yeah. you didn't want me showing off what wasn't the finished product. Uh, this is the finished product. The difference is huge. And when I say that, I mean people will comment now and compliment my teeth, That's but nice. they'll say it sincerely, and it won't be yeah. kind of. Oh, have you had something done? <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know, they're very nice. You know the difference <laughs> yeah, between yeah. somebody kind of being embarrassed and the same. Yeah, they're lovely. Yeah, yeah. So you go, God, they're really nice, man. Yeah. They're really suited, they look real. They look natural. You know, and that's what yeah. you want. It's that side of it you want. Exactly, that's what you look for, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. And how about pain? I'd right? be a bit of a wimp. You're a bit of a lightweight, to, I know. Yeah, a bit of a lightweight when it comes to pain and stuff. <laughs> and I have to be honest, it was not anywhere near where I thought it was going to be. Before we went for the veneers, you, um, you straightened my bottom teeth. Yeah. And that was more invasive to me yeah. than getting the veneers done because you, you put on and it wasn't even you didn't put train tracks on you just put the, the invis um, invisible yeah, invisible braces the invisible, the invisible braces on yeah. and uh, I just I didn't like it yeah, you know? yeah, yeah. I mean you get used to it and it's yeah, fine yeah, yeah, yeah. but what I'm trying to say is that was more uncomfortable of course. than getting the actual veneers done yeah. which kind of goes against the grain I suppose but that's the truth Thanks so many for coming in to talk to us, right? No problem at all. Um, and I suppose we get a commission for every role you get in Hollywood now. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <laughs> they get that little star shining in my tooth. Ding! <laughs> Ding. Teeth done by Barry Buckley and Kane Hospital <laughs> Winkle there. <laughs> so Barry, before we go, yeah. can I just ask you, does, um, does uh, Barry... No, it doesn't matter, we won't say it, we won't go there, just in case. What? <laughs> <laughs>